What has happened to Lulu? Explain in physics. Today, we are going to explain about a poem by using physics theory. The, the poem title is What has happened to Lulu? In this poem, Lulu has jumped out of the window in his boyfriend's car and then his boyfriend brought Lulu and ran away from his house, from her house, sorry. So we assume that Lulu mass is 50 kg, great gravitational acceleration as 10 meter per second per second, height of the window is 2.7 meter, and initial velocity is 0 ms negative okay, 1. Okay, today we are going to calculate the final velocity of Lulu before she reached the floor. So we will be calculating V. So from the information given, we have A, the acceleration of Lulu, which is 10 ms minus 2. And we have the height from the window, which is, which is S equals to 2.7 meter. And we have the initial velocity of her, which is 0 ms minus 1. So we need to calculate the final velocity. So we missing a V, we have A, S, and U. So we will be using the linear motion equation, which is V squared equals to U squared plus 2AS. So we substitute in the value. U is 0, 2A, and S, 2.7. So after calculating, we will get the answer which is 7.3 ms minus 1. We have round off the answer, of course. Okay, now we will be calculating her impulsive force when she reached the floor. So we have two situations, which she without bending her legs and she bent her legs. So we assume that the collision time between her leg and the floor is 0 0.1 second when she didn't bend her legs. So we use the formula which is F equals to MV minus MU over T. So we substitute in the value 50, 0. So the final velocity is 0. Because when she reaches her leg, she stops. When she sorry, when she reaches the floor, she stops. So the final velocity is zero. And before she reaches the floor, her velocity is seven point three. So it, the u is seven point three, not zero. So after we calculate, the answer is negative three six five zero kg ms minus two. We have negative. This is because it's the floor acting on her legs, so it's negative. Now. Let us calculate when she bends her legs. We assume that the time taken is t equals to 1.0 seconds. The formula and we substitute in the value. The same, so the one difference is only the time. So the answer is 3, negative 365 kg ms minus 2, which is 10 times less than the impulsive force when she didn't bend her legs. So when you jump down, Remember to bend your leg, so you can increase the collision time in order to reduce the impulsive force, so you won't break your leg so easily. But of course, don't jump down off the floor because negative three six five kg ms minus two also will, is a is also an large impulsive force which which will break your legs too.